It's a life Ahed Tamimi couldn't have anticipated. Shooting to fame when she was 11 by staring down Israeli soldiers, the young Palestinian was on a path to international prominence, but also prison. It was this video in late 2017 of her hitting a soldier that for Israel was the last straw. Moments before the incident, an Israeli soldier had shot her cousin in the head with a rubber bullet. He survived. Do you regret hitting the soldier? I believe that I didn't do something wrong. I didn't go to the soldier. The soldier came to my house. The soldier forced me to do this. This is a normal reaction for what happened. Days later, police raided the 16-year-old's home and arrested her. Israel's defense minister told reporters at the time, whoever goes wild during the day will be arrested at night. Her trial in an Israeli military court lasted months. It became a lightning rod for criticism of the IDF and its treatment of Palestinian youth. Tamimi finally pled guilty to four charges of criminal acts where she disrupted an IDF soldier and carried out incitement. She'd serve a total of eight months in prison. Released Sunday, Tamimi received a hero's homecoming. But the teenager who became a Palestinian icon first wanted pistachio ice cream. It's a wonderful feeling. I haven't eaten ice cream in a long time. It's a wonderful feeling that I hope all the female prisoners are released and can eat ice cream. Israeli officials were mute about her release. Tamimi celebrated her 17th birthday in prison and graduated high school. She says she learned patience and studied human rights. All the while, her notoriety only grew. How do you feel that you're now a symbol of the Palestinian cause? Of course it makes me happy and so proud that I succeeded to deliver the message of prisoners, my homeland and nation. God willing, I will succeed to deliver the message that Palestinians are suffering because of occupation. Now free? Her message is of Palestinian unity and hasn't ruled out a career in politics, but one step at a time. In the future, I will register for university and study law, and someday I want to be a famous lawyer to defend my country. The world and Palestinian society will watch Ahid Tamimi closely. So too will Israeli authorities, as she's currently on parole. Ian Lee, CNN. In Nabisale, the West Bank.